awkward and timely conversation is happening at the University of Miami. Scientists are talking about the link between climate change and extreme weather. NBC6 meteorologist Steve McLaughlin was at UM and joins us now with the details on the discussion. For all of us living in South Florida, we know that this is ground zero for climate change. So it makes sense that the television station in Miami that's most aggressive with climate change coverage, NBC6, and the university in South Florida that's most aggressive with research on climate change, University of Miami, have been teaming up to bring you climate change stories. Well, today is the final day of a three-day symposium where very smart and influential and important people in the fight against climate change have been getting together and talking about the issues, not just globally, but for us here in South Florida. I had the pleasure and honor to be part of a panel where we talked about some local effects of climate change and for me personally, how the media has been covering climate change. In South Florida, flooding that we talked about before that happens on sunny days is crazy. There are parts of the world that can't wrap their mind around how this is possible. And then they come here and see it and we report on it. And the last round of King Tides, it was record setting. Mosquito season and some of these illnesses, if you add, uh, you know, three weeks to a mosquito season, imagine how much more breeding that is. Imagine how far north the mosquitoes and the disease can now travel. So what you're taking a look at right now is video that was played at the beginning of today's symposium, which was open to the public. Of course, this is our very own Angie Lastman. As you might know, she traveled to Australia over the last week, not just to cover the wildfires, but to talk about the global implications of the wildfires and climate change. This was the first year for the symposium, but everyone here is hoping this will become an annual tradition. Reporting from Coral Gables and University of Miami, meteorologist Steve McLaughlin, NBC6.